Yeah, I was, I was, I was here initially for tennis, and I think they forgot about me. And uh, I got the chance to play today. Uh, they gave me a call, told me, Steph, uh, you're playing on Monday, so I made my way through to uh, to the next round, uh, which uh, it's quite uh, it's a quite nice feeling always to win and to give yourself uh, a chance to fight out there. Um, definitely a great day. And, uh, I'm looking forward to the next one. Opening round matches are never tough, especially when it's the third round to start for you, you know, your first match here. And then playing somebody from Argentina, you know, down here, a lot of support. How, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you are right, Chile. That's my bad. Uh, playing someone from Chile. How did you handle, what are you most proud of how you handled it out there? I mean, all I could hear out there was uh, my the first uh, three letters of my surname being pronounced uh, uh, every once in a while, uh, which uh, I think also uh, aligned with the uh, the first three letters of the country that they were shouting for him, uh, which made it fun. And it, it was a, a very funny scenario that uh, I'm not exposed to much. Uh, but, uh, I felt I felt I felt the love of the crowd, regardless of uh, uh, the majority of it, which was uh, Chileans. Uh, I I enjoyed myself out there. It was fun. It was it was a great afternoon. And. Uh, I did struggle a little bit with uh, in the beginning to get myself acclimatized and, and start, get a good start, but eventually, um, you know, things uh, things sort of went by my side. You said you've been enjoying Miami as well. A lot of players talk about the food down here. Is there something else that you really like about Miami? About Miami, uh, I, Wynwood is one of my favorite places in Miami, and I've uh, I've developed. Uh, very nice relationship with that place, and, and it starts to grow on me every single time that I visit. So um, that would be my biggest recommendation or suggestion to someone just visiting Miami and asking me what's the most artsy, creative, uh, uh, call it funky place in Miami. Yeah, I would I would recommend for them to go there. Well, it's a cool area. Congrats on the win and Thanks. good luck.